Venice, Italy. Venice is a city in northeastern Italy and the capital of the Veneta region. It is built on a group of 118 small islands that are separated by canals and linked by over 400 bridges. The islands are in the shallow Venetian lagoon, an enclosed bay lying between the mouths of the Po and the Piave rivers. The Grand Canal is a channel in Venice, Italy. It forms one of the major water traffic corridors in the city. One end of the canal leads into the lagoon near the Santa Lucia railway station and the other end leads into the basin at San Marco and between, it makes a large reverse S shape through the central districts of Venice. It is 3.8 kilometers, 2.4 miles, long, and 30 to 90 meters, 98 to 295 feet, wide, with an average depth of 5 meters, 16 feet. The banks of the Grand Canal are lined with more than 170 buildings, most of which date from the 13th to the 18th century, and demonstrate the welfare and art created by the Republic of Venice. The noble Venetian families faced huge expenses to show off their richness in suitable palazzos. This contest reveals the citizens' pride and the deep bond with the lagoon. Amongst the many are the Palazzi Barbara, C. A. Rezzonego, C. A. Doro, Palazzo Dario, C. A. Foscari, Palazzo Barbarigo and to Palazzo Venier de Leone, housing the Peggy Guggenheim collection. The churches along the canal include the Basilica of Santa Maria della Salute. Centuries-old traditions, such as the historical regatta are perpetuated every year along the canal. Santa Maria della Salute the Basilica of Santa Maria della Salute is one of the best known in Venice, whose dome is visible from all over the city. It was constructed to celebrate the end of the plague in 1631. The Basilica of Santa Maria della Salute is situated in the district of Dorsaduro in Venice. Santa Maria della Salute commonly known simply as the Salute, is a Roman Catholic church and minor basilica located at Punta della Dogana in the Dorsa Duro Sestier of the city of Venice, Italy. It stands on the narrow finger of Punta della Dogana, between the Grand Canal and the Giudecca Canal, at the Bacino di San Marco, making the church visible when entering the Piazza San Marco from the water. The salute is part of the parish of the Gesuati and is the most recent of the so-called plague churches. In 1630, Venice experienced an unusually devastating outbreak of the plague. As a votive offering for the city's deliverance from the pestilence, the Republic of Venice vowed to build and dedicate a church to Our Lady of Health, or of Deliverance, Italian, Salute. The church was designed in the then fashionable Baroque style by Baldassare Longhena, who studied under the architect Vincenzo Scamozzi. Construction began in 1631. Most of the objects of art housed in the church bear references to the Black Death. The Dome of the Salute was an important addition to the Venice skyline and soon became emblematic of the city, inspiring artists like Conaletto, J. M. W. Turner, John Singer Sargent, and the Venetian artist Francesco Gardi. 46,000 people died whilst in the lagoons the number was far higher, some 94,000. Repeated displays of the sacrament, as well as prayers and processions to churches dedicated to San Rocco and San Lorenzo Giustiniani had failed to stem the epidemic. Echoing the architectural response to a prior assault of the plague, 1575-76, when Palladio was asked to design the Red and Torre Church, the Venetian Senate on October 22, 1630, decreed that a new church would be built. It was not to be dedicated to a mere plague or patron saint, but to the Virgin Mary, who for many reasons was thought to be a protector of the Republic. On November 21st the Feast of the Presentation of the Virgin, known as the Festa della Madonna della Salute, the city's officials parade from San Marco to the Salute for a service in gratitude for deliverance from the plague is celebrated. This involved crossing the Grand Canal on a specially constructed pontoon bridge and is still a major event in Venice. Piazza San Marco Piazza San Marco often known in English as St. Mark's Square, is the principal public square of Venice, Italy, where it is generally known just as La Piazza, the square. 
all other urban spaces in the city, except the Piazzetta and the Piazzale Roma, are called Compi, fields. The Piazzetta, Little Piazza Slash Square, is an extension of the piazza towards San Marco Basin in its southeast corner, Sea Plan. The two spaces together form the social, religious and political center of Venice and are commonly considered together. This article relates to both of them. The square is dominated at its eastern end by St. Mark's Basilica. It is described here by a perambulation starting from the west front of the church, facing the length of the piazza, and proceeding to the right. The church is described in the article St. Mark's Basilica, but there are aspects of it which are so much a part of the piazza that mentioned here, including the whole of its western facade with its great arches and marble decoration, the Romanesque carvings around the central doorway and, the four horses which preside over the whole piazza and are such potent symbols of the pride and power of Venice that the Genoese in 1379 said that there could be no peace between the two cities until these horses had been bridled. 400 years later, Napoleon, after he had conquered Venice, had them taken down and shipped to Paris. The history of the Piazza San Marco can be conveniently covered in four periods. But the only pre-Renaissance buildings and monuments still standing there are St. Mark's, the Doge's Palace and the two great columns in the Piazzetta. The first patron saint of Venice was St. Theodore, a Greek warrior saint, and the first chapel of the Doge was dedicated to him. It was probably built about 819 and stood near the site of the present church of St. Mark. In 828 to 829 relics of St. Mark were stolen from Alexandria and brought to Venice, and in time the Venetians and the Doge adopted the Apostle as their new patron. He was the missionary Apostle who was said to have converted their district, the relics of an Apostle would increase the importance of the city and their acquisition was a further step in the gradual process of freeing Venice from the domination of Byzantium. In 976 there was a rebellion against the doge and the church was set on fire. The wooden parts, including the roof and wooden dome, were probably lost, but the church was not completely destroyed and it seems to have been rebuilt much as before. In 1063 a complete rebuilding commenced. The new church was finished in the time of Doge Vitali Foyer, 1084-96 and in its main structure this is the present church, though the west front facing the piazza was then in the Romanesque style with undecorated brickwork, like the exterior of the apse today. It had five domes, but their exterior profile was low, unlike the present high, onion-shaped structures. Great changes to the area came when Sebastiano Ziani was doge, 1172-78. Venice was growing in importance and the doge was a very wealthy man. He initiated the changes which created the piazza as we know it. The Rio Baratario was filled in and the church of San Geminiano on the far side was demolished and rebuilt much farther back at the western end of what became the piazza. An orchard which occupied part of the area was acquired from the convent of San Zachariah and the doge bought up a number of buildings which obstructed the site. By his will he left these buildings to the state and in due course they were demolished to clear the area. The rebuilding of the 9th century Doge's palace also commenced in his time as Doge. The precise state of the various new buildings is not known and much must have been done in the time of his son, Pietro Ziani, who was Doge from 1205 to 1229. St. Mark's Basilica the Patriarchal Cathedral Basilica of St. Mark commonly known as St. Mark's Basilica is the cathedral church of the Roman Catholic Patriarchate of Venice in northern Italy. It is the most famous of the city's churches and one of the best known examples of Italo-Byzantine architecture. It lies at the eastern end of the Piazza San Marco, adjacent and connected to the Doge's Palace. Originally it was the chapel of the Doge, and has been the city's cathedral only since 1807, when it became the seat of the Patriarch of Venice, 1, Archbishop of the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of Venice, formerly at San Pietro di Castello. 
The building's structure dates back to the later part of the 11th century, and the most likely influence on its architecture and design was the Church of the Holy Apostles in Constantinople. Much work has gone toward embellishing this, and the famous main facade has an ornamented roof line that is mostly Gothic. The gold ground mosaics that now cover almost all the upper areas of the interior took centuries to complete. In the 13th century the external height of the domes was greatly increased by hollow drums raised on a wooden framework and covered with metal, the original ones are shallower, as can be seen on the inside. Many of its rich artifacts and relics were plundered from Constantinople in the Fourth Crusade in 1204, including many artifacts from the Hagia Sophia, the famous Madonna Nicopia, also known as the Icon of the Virgin Nicopia, was looted from the Monastery of Staudios and was one of the city's most precious icons, carried into battle by various Byzantine emperors. The icon was brought to Venice by Enrico Dondolo, d. 1205, and the altar of the Virgin Nicopia remains in St. Mark's Basilica until today. The relics of St. Mark are recorded in Venice as early as the 9th century in both the will of Doge Giustiniano Participazio, in office 827 to 829, and the travelogue of a Frankish monk on return from a pilgrimage to the Holy Land. However, the oldest surviving written account of the translation, the transfer of the relics from Alexandria in Egypt to Venice, dates only to the 11th century, although earlier writings evidently existed and were used as sources. During the 13th century, the emphasis of the church's function seems to have changed from being the private chapel of the doge to that of a state church, with increased power for the procurators. It was the location for the great public ceremonies of the state, such as the installation and burials of doges, though as space ran out and the demand for grander tombs increased, from the 15th century Santi Giovanni e Paolo became the usual burial place. The function of the basilica remained the same until 1807, after the end of the Venetian Republic, when the basilica finally became subject to the local bishop, the Patriarch of Venice, though from the 12th century he had had a throne there, opposite the doges. The transfer of the see was ordered by Napoleon during his period of control of Venice. Before this, Venice's cathedral from 1451 was the much less grand San Pietro di Castello, 